Well, hello again, everybody. Mental Fox here. Thank you for joining me again on this playthrough of Dragon Age Inquisition. We're here in Valimar, and uh, I'm a little worried because um, I can't fast travel out of here. I've tried to before, and it doesn't seem to be an option. And I'm pretty low on my uh, health potions. I've only got two left for my entire party. Uh, I do have regeneration potions, though. I've got five myself. Sarah's got three. Uh, Cassandra's got all five of hers, and um, Vivienne has four of hers, so hopefully that uh, will be enough to make it through here. I don't know how big this place is going to be, but uh, I have a feeling it'll probably be pretty big. Getting ready to head down here, and when we were here before, we saw this guy down here. He was shooting at something, and I think one of my party members made a comment about Darkspawn, so thinking that maybe there was some dark spawn down there. And if you look at my little mini map down here, there's something going on down this way, but I don't know what. I'm not sure exactly where that is. Uh, but uh, I imagine we're going to find out soon enough. Um, I'm going to go visible and go down here and just take a look around and see if he has any of their buddies with him. Just to make sure that I'm not going to get ambushed or something. Okay. Yeah, he's already hurting quite a bit uh, because of, uh, I guess, some dark spawn or something. I don't know what. I don't see any dark spawn bodies down here, but there may be some over there. So, oh, let's go ahead and um, surprise this guy. Oh, where are you going, dude? Dude, where are you going? Oh, oh my gosh, that was almost almost a deadly move right there. I almost fell right off the edge. Need to be more aware of my surroundings before I do that spin move that, uh, what do they call it? The, it is called the leaping shot. It's a pretty cool move though, it does a lot of damage. There's the Hiver Weave and a bowstring. Creature research item, okay. I have to remember to take that back to uh, Menave or whatever her name is. Ooh, there's somebody over there. We've got a uh, Herlock. Well, that is a de dark spawn, isn't it? A herlock? I believe it is. Huh. What's this thing seeing? Oh, loot over there. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and uh, take on this herlock, shall we? Let's see how hard he is to take out. Whoa. What is that? Oh, he's dead. <laughs> I'm sitting here doing leaping shots and he's dead. Open? Alright, let me grab this loot here real quick before we open this and see where it goes. I wonder if this is plaid weave. Okay. I wonder if that's where I'm going to find this big party of dudes waiting for me right here. Probably. Huh, it's a little, a little scary. Yeah, there's a bunch of, there's a bunch of dudes in there. We've got... Level 8 Carta Leader, level 8 Bowman. Hmm. I don't have any jars of bees left. If I did, I would consider making myself invisible and running in there and throwing a jar of bees at them, but that doesn't seem to be an option. Uh, I don't want to take them all on at once, but, um... Sometimes I have trouble keeping my party where I want them. Let's go ahead and give it a shot. Let's go ahead and um, let's, let's check their leader. I'm going to go ahead and take a shot at him and see what happens. Alright. Oh, they're pushing me in. Okay. Ouch. Alright. Let's come out here again. Come back out here, guys. Come back out here. Guys, come out here. Would take your time. Hey, where the, what the where did you come from? What the? I'm dead. What? Uh. Okay. Disengage. Follow me. What's going on here? That uh, happened very, very, very quickly. Let's run up here and hopefully respawn. I've been in here, right? 
Pretty sure I've already been in here. Yeah, the trading post is, is named to whatever that means. Okay. Ooh, there's a bad guy. In the corner there? What? Weird. Huh. Oh, I thought I switched back to myself, but I guess I didn't. Huh. Weird. Was that guy there before? Oh, now I'm really worried. Loot. Huh. That was, uh, strangeness. Where is this loot you speak of? Okay. Or plaid weave. So now... Myself and Vivienne are in trouble health-wise, so now I'm gonna have to take my take another one of my regeneration potions and have her take one of hers. Uh, yeah, this has got me worried. That room down there. I mean, that's a lot of dudes. Uh, I was trying to be smart about it and kind of try to pull them out, but um, that wasn't working so well. Let's see here. See if we could fight a little bit better out here. Man, somebody hits really, really hard. Okay, let's, let's back up a little bit. Okay, who else we got? It's hard to see through all this fire. Whoa, there's a big dude here. Oh, oh. Whoa. Okay, that was pretty crazy. I wonder how many of them are left alive. Huh. It was nice that they were sitting on the stairs there. Oh, doggone it, there's a guy right down there. What the hell? Still don't know what it means when they grow purple like that. Um girl, you need to go ahead and take a, whoops, a healing potion. Go ahead, it's okay. It's alright. Why does he keep exploding? Is that a spell that somebody's casting? I don't know. I damn you know. Okay, who else is left in this room? Oh gosh, did we actually kill them all? Maybe we did. I don't know. Uh, let's see. Oh, energize. There's something to energize down there. I don't know what that's going to be about. Doggone it, another guy. Where do these guys keep coming from? He's just standing there. Are you trying to run away? Whoa. I've got about enough of those guys just showing up out of nowhere. Let's go in here and see what's up. The vat room. Are there more bad guys over there? No, it doesn't look like it. Ooh, something to read. Orders for lake operations. Check on operations at the lake. Make sure they're doing their jobs down there. Don't let them give you shit about the wildlife. I don't care. Take Liska with you. Give her something to do. She's been on edge, complaining about humming or some nonsense. If she can't handle the job, deal with it. Alright. Whoa, all kinds of stuff down here. These guys are readers. Report on activity in the hinterlands. The soldiers call themselves the Inquisition. They've been helping the refugees near Redcliffe. Poking around a fair bit, too, though they haven't come near here. They're talking about us. They have someone with a trick for closing those rifts. Ah, oh, that's me. Some rich marcher they're claiming was sent by Andraste. Zealous nug shit, if you ask me. Just a brat wanting a new title so he can win the noble pissing match back home. If the mercenaries do their job, we shouldn't have a problem. Still, keep an eye out. Okay. Our movements. Yeah, they have, haven't they? What's this? Personal note scrawled in a ledger. It's good, though red. With the Templars severing ties to the Chantry, we should find buyers easily enough. It has to be the right buyer, though. Don't want anyone who will get ideas. We need to control distribution. If travel across Lake Callanhead is secured, we're made. Most of the veins have been near the surface. There's enough of it, but if we find a deeper vein, a source, the take could be huge. Once we have a firm grip on the current operation, we could look into its expansion. 
Okay. See, I think they're talking about red lyrium. And forgive me if that was obvious to everyone but me, but that's what I think. Dwarven gear? Dwarven gear. This appears to be a machined... This appears to be machined dwarven gear. Alright, let's take it. Ooh, I found a gear. Alright. Hmm. Uh, what's this business? What are these things? Replace gear. Okay, I replaced that gear. So now I need to find... A gear Something's for this missing. one. Something's missing. What could it be? Ooh, another book to read. Okay. Darktown's Deal. Ask the nobles of Orzammar how their kingdom gets silks and grain and wine from the surface, and they'll tell you trade with the surface occurs. It occurs, as if, it, as if on its own, with no traders or merchants or human farmers involved. A little miracle of dwarven ingenuity. The real, reality is a lot messier than their fantasy. Orzammar relies upon the surface not just for its prosperity, but for its survival. Ages of blights have taken thousands of thags away from the dwarves. I think it's actually pronounced tigs. These were the places where most of the food was raised. The dwarven kingdom that endured alone, independent beneath the stone from time immemorial, perished in the first blight, faded into myth. Now the remaining dwarves underground cling to existence through a lifeline to the surface, a chain forged from the castless. Every dwarf who goes to the surface is stripped of caste, effectively exiled and removed from dwarven society forever. But Orzammar relies on continued relations with these exiles to live. This has created a shadowy area of dwarven trade and politics where the rich, powerful, and elite maintain strict secret ties to people who, by official decree, no longer exist, and everyone knows what kinds of things lurk in the shadows. The Karta lives in the underbelly of the, underbelly of the surface trade like a tapeworm. Many surface dwarves maintain ties, not officially recognized of course, but respectable, to their former houses in the noble or merchant castes, and those contacts are their means of trading with Orzammar. Those who have no ties, because they were cast off by their families or never had good connections, make the trip back underground to trade with Orzammar personally, where they find themselves treated like criminals. A castless in Orzammar, even a wealthy one from the surface, will be driven away from most merchants treated like he's carrying a plague at best. So these surface merchants turn to the Carta for help. The Carta acts as a contact in Orzammar for surface businesses and sells their goods on the black market. For a cut, of course. The Carta always gets its cut. The outraged citizens of Orzammar sometimes petition the assembly to deal with the rampant crime surrounding the black market, and showy displays are made of kicking in the doors to Carta hideouts and raising dust down. But the Carta always comes back, because the assembly always allows it. Too much of Orzammar is dependent on the black market trade, and the nobles know it. They all do business with the Carta. Everyone has a stake in its success. The Carta has a thousand faces above and below the surface. Honest merchants and noble caste lords and upstanding members of the Merchants Guild, all a cover for the thousands more smugglers, thieves, and murderers in the shadows. The life of Orzammar, praise the ancestors. Oh, the lifeline. Exerted from Darktown's deal by Varric Tethris. Well, that guy's quite the writer. Oh, now what? Oh, okay, so it's just telling me about that. So, we need to find another gear to get through that door. Um, stairs. Those are the stairs we originally came down? I think they are. We came down these stairs, had a little bit of a battle here, yeah. And this is the bridge that the uh, darkspawn seem to keep coming across. So let's see if we can make it across this bridge. I'm going to look over here first just to make sure there's not anything I'm missing. And I don't think there is. There's a ladder to go down. So I guess we need to go across this bridge. Whoa, that goes a long way over there. Hmm. Oh, I'm not real sure which way we should be going. Oh, that guy just appeared out of nowhere. Where the heck did he come from? Discovered Halls of the Elders. Okay. Oh, here we go. I'm going to come around behind you. I'm going to give you one of these. Say it like that. You don't like it at all, do you? Oh, he's looking at me. Why is he just standing there? It seems like whenever he turns purple, my party just stands there. So I'm wondering if when he's purple, is he invisible to my party? I don't know. Recruits Dirk. Okay. All right. 
right, so if we go down those stairs, it looks like we'll end up down there. Ooh, there's a big dude down there. Level 8 Herlock Alpha. That's kind of scary sounding and looking. Hmm. Uh, what, is, what is this thing seeing? Hmm. Okay, it's not this way. What the? Get out of my way. Okay, it's that Drake stone down there. Huh. Man, I really don't want to take him on. Is this a door? It's not. What? I can open it. Alright. Whoa. What's going on in here? Huh. Man, this place is pretty crazy. 